How are we doing today everyone? My name is TK Royal. Welcome back to another game of Bed Wars and I have a pretty serious topic to talk about today. You know, usually with these commentaries I like to make them kind of funny. Um, this guy's just going way too slow for my, okay, I don't even know what he accomplished. But, you know, usually I like to try to keep these commentaries lighthearted, keep them fun. But today, unfortunately, we have a very serious topic, a very, very, um, very uh, controversial issue that is not me failing to speed bridge, you know. That was just me. I just had to get in for every episode, you know, just got to try to keep trends going on here. Um, but you see a problem here is I'm doing the, um, I'm doing like the, the series where I just like talk about whatever you guys want me to talk about. You like leave a comment you should just do that on this video so we can get people going. But one of the things I've always tried to avoid is just really just like anything politics, you know, because politics really, I've just never been a fan of them. Um, they always, okay, this guy needs to die for me. I'm just going to pretend I won that fight for audience retention. But you see the thing with politics is I, I've never really been a big fan of them. Big fan of politics, just because, you know, the, the effect it has on people, you know, because usually like, it always brings out of this or that question. It makes it makes us always have to choose a side, always and it never really live coming together, and it always separates people. So I've never been a big fan of politics, but unfortunately, um, this, this channel being your number one source of news, trust me, I know it is, don't lie to yourself, um, I just have to bring attention to certain issues that just must be talked about. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to be tackling a very, very political, very heavily debated question that I really did not want to talk about. But, you know, I'd, um, I'm here, get, get ready to be canceled. Um, it's brought in by Fedham here. And is a hot dog a sandwich or a taco? But you see, a taco versus, let's say, a sandwich. Now, we, we, need, to, we need to figure out what exactly each are before we can go applying them to everything anything you know so for example let's take um a taco here now a taco those are usually you know hard or soft you're going to get them the same way where they are in like a, a u-shaped starch okay because that's the only thing we can really apply to both of them For most of the times it's going to be starch based um corn or flour bread, wheat, grain, something, and then some sort of meat in the middle, okay? That's like the only um, common denominator I can find between these two vastly different um, items of of consumption. So with a taco, it's like a U-shaped where, where both sides are connected at one point. And then you have all the, the meat and the toppings and everything in the middle, right? So, so we're going to go by that de definition for a taco. And if it's not the Oxford t Dictionary, okay, what, why is our bed just out in the open here? What's, what kind of bed defense is this? Guys, we have other blocks than wool in the game. We, Guys, someone can just purchase shield, shears for 20 iron, and it's, no, this is not a good bed defense. This is not swap. Okay, whatever. We kind of deserve to die at this point. So now that we've defined taco, let's just go ahead and define a sandwich. So we're all on the same page here, okay? A sandwich, I'm going to be just defining it as two pieces of bread with meat inside, okay? But the thing is, they're separated. With the taco, they're sit with their, they're, they're conjoined at one end, and the, the sandwich, they're combined, okay? So that's going to be the key. That's going to be the key differences we're going off of, right? Okay? And... Now we need to define the hot dog, okay? Because we don't really know. Okay, well, what, what's, 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 where, 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 where's, where's the line here, okay? So with the hot dog, you're going to see most... Okay, I'm not going to even say most of the time. It's not a hot dog otherwise. Hot dog is a hot dog bun with a hot dog inside. Now there's different types of variations of this. Like in Germany, you're going to see the bratwurst and brochen with the, you know, the, the bratwurst, the sausage with a very like circular piece of bread inside. And it's a variation of, of basically an American hot dog. I don't know which one is here first. I don't know where the copyright issues go, but as a proud American, I'm, I'm probably going to give it to the Germans because what, what haven't we stolen at this point? But I can say with certainty that knowing these two um, bits of information, that we can logically assume that um, a hot dog would be a taco, right? Because a hot dog bun, as we all know, a, is conjoined at one part, right? So the, logically speaking, that would make it a... Um, you're not going to fireball me. Now, logically speaking, that would make it a taco, right? I mean, it just makes sense. That was like the worst attempt at a fireball. I don't even know what happened there, but I'm just going to, just going to blame it on his just horrible PVP skills. Speaking of horrible PVP skills, case in point. But one of the problems here that we all have to come to realize is that taco and sandwich are very loose in terms of defining a hot dog. 
because let's you let's be real we've had hot dogs we've, we've had a fair amount of hot dogs right now i can say with certainty that some of the times uh, now i can say with certainty that several of the times i have eaten said hot dog you know some of time some of the times you know the the bun's a bit too old or it's too moist or something you know let's say you put it in the microwave i don't know what type of imbecile would ever put a hot dog in the microwave but let's say you would do something like that and that's gonna get the bun soggy right because i i know you know i'm not very proud of my country i know people have done that in the past so i'm just gonna go off that but you know a soggy hot dog bun that's no fun to eat but you know here we are and one of the problems that that ha happens because of that is now you're going to get a bun that is likely to split in half, right? Because, you know, it happens sometimes when you just like, let's say you open it for this first time and it just kind of opens a bit too much and it just kind of splits apart. And now you kind of have like a the, 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 the hot dog, but like there's just too much now where like it's, it's, it's gone completely through. In that instance, it has become a sandwich. Call me crazy. I know all the comments are like TK Royal. You, you just, you just, you know, curse my entire bloodline with that. How could you? You know, I've been raised for this many years believing this, and you just told me that it's this. How could you? And I don't blame you. It's a very controversial statement to make, especially in this day and age when you know all we're talking about in media is just hot dogs, hot dogs. TK, stop with the hot dogs. It's just, it's too much. Okay, I just want to escape from politics. Well, too bad. Okay, because TK Royal Channel is not an escape. You, you can't, this guy is trying to escape here. You can't escape death. Death is inevitable. And so are hot dogs. Hot dogs are inevitable. Okay, that's the takeaway here. So, I mean, now that now that we've um, correctly identified... Um, okay, this just... I don't even want any part of that. But now that we've correctly identified what how hot dogs... Okay, that's just someone at our base just mining into our bed. And... Okay, that's just like... I just witnessed my downfall. And so now that we've correctly identified what a hot dog is, at least theoretically, because... In reality, a hot dog is neither of the two options listed. But you know, just for simply simplicity's sake, we're just going to go with the fact that one of you would be correct in this assumption. And okay, that just didn't happen. Okay, stop hitting me, please. But you see, now that we've correctly identified that um, a um, a hot dog can, in fact, become a sandwich or a taco, depending on how it's how it's weathered, how it's crafted, how it's put together. And you know that that means okay, it can be it can be formed this or that way. And which is true, it is very true, okay? But one of the things we have to look up at is, um, couldn't that mean we could take it the other way? Where a hot dog or a, uh, a sandwich is um, put together another certain way, right? But while this is true, it is also not true because say you took a taco, right? And you split the bottom of that in parts. So now you have what in theoretically would be a sandwich, right? Because that's where our conclusion is going. No, you are completely wrong. You are false. That is just a taco, but just broken in half. The rules doesn't apply there. You take a sandwich and you, I don't know, hot glue part of them together. Now you just now you just have a sandwich with a stupid mess. Like you just look dumb now. So I think I think the best way to do this is just look at some real facts here, okay? So unfortunately, there's no Earl of Taco, but there's an Earl of Sandwich. So let's look at his information here. So unfortunately, the Earl sandwich has been dead 500 years. So the closest account we can get right here is the line of succession, where we have the 11th Earl of Sandwich, John. Look at John. What a nice guy. Now, unfortunately, there's no actual information on what a sandwich is. I was expecting a definition on the sandwich to be in the Earl of Sandwich. You know, that's all they're good for. But unfortunately, there's literally nothing here, just boring facts about them. So TK editor, editor TK, just go ahead and just put some put some nice facts that support me and no other claims so I look smart and and yes okay thank you see you see right here you can tell right here that I actually am correct in this um, assumption that a sandwich um, a hot dog in fact is not a sandwich or a taco it's a hot dog but if it had to be under a specific category it would be a taco because the two sides are combined and then if you take it apart it's a sandwich so it's a very it's a it's a um, a gender fluid sandwich there we go so now that we've discovered that a uh, a hot dog is in fact a gender fluid sandwich we can move on with our lives and just all just happily just accept the fact that i i am completely correct in this and thank you for this comment i did not just waste the last 20 minutes of my life talking about tacos sandwiches and hot dogs all three things i never want to hear about for the rest of my life